Hi, my name is Claire and I'm an online English teacher. This is my puppy, Rusty, and this video just shows you some of the places we explore here in Scotland. Good morning, I'm just about to start my day. I'm going to have a look at my schedule and start planning my lessons and make some breakfast. I just thought I'd give you a quick 360 of our office so you can see where I work. Uh, you can see the setup and uh, it's very comfortable. And I've also got our dog here, Rusty, with me too. Um, and next I'll show you my workstation and how my computer is set up. Okay, so this is my workstation uh, and this is where I spend most of my day teaching English online. Uh, I have a huge bottle of water that I fill up quite a few times to keep me going through teaching. And I've just made my breakfast today. It's Greek yogurt with homegrown strawberries. Yes, we can actually grow strawberries in Scotland. Can you believe it? And a big mug of tea. Uh, next to me, I've got all my resources so that I can plan my lessons extensively um, and provide my students with lots of variety. At the moment, I'm just planning my um, classes with Evelina. We're going to start looking at future tenses. So I'm having a look at exercises for those. And I'm also looking um, at planning my Cambridge class. So we're looking at reported speech later this week. Um, and I'm taking a look at some books for that. And I also use these role play, ca role play cards, um, which is good for pair work and things. And we can use them online as well. Um, I've also had a look this morning already at um, the level test that the British Council uh, provide online. Um, I've got a few clients that want classes and I'd like them to take the level test so I can see what level they are. This will be really useful for them and for me so that I can plan their lessons. Generally, I work Monday to Friday and I teach online to a few students that I have internationally. I mark lesson plans to help teachers that are in training. I deliver training sessions for teachers, new teachers, and I do some social media for um, a Scottish um, group of teachers and managers. Um, so my day sort of starts with when I'm teaching Evelina. So she's my student in Moscow. And before I link up with her, I check that my equipment is okay. I check that my camera is working. I have um, a standalone microphone. I don't wear earphones um, because I just use my computer audio. So I check that's okay. I go into the Zoom meeting probably about 15 minutes before we meet so that I'm ready for her. I can have the Zoom meeting open. I can go and make a cup of tea before it starts. Uh, I usually send her materials in advance. I find that helps students so that they can see that before the lesson starts. Um, they can do some work on it if they want, or we can start it when we start the lesson. And then I'll have a tea break. I'll probably have a quick play with our puppy, Rusty. And I'll look at my next online session, which is training teachers. Um, and I think about um, what I'm going to do in that lesson with the teachers. So we usually do uh, some warmers. We discuss lesson planning and we'll go through the functions of Zoom. Uh, for example, breakout rooms, uh, how we use the chat box um, and things like that. So I'm just on a quick lunch break and I've come down to the beach. I've brought Rusty with me. It's a beautiful day here in sunny Scotland and we've even managed to see some seals. After lunch, I'll come back to the computer and I'll work on looking at uh, teacher training and language articles online and then I have a lesson at about 5.30 with um, a Swiss guy. Um, his name is Marcus and he is he has a family in Switzerland, he has two children, he works in finance and he's actually studying for an exam in English so he's studying for IELTS so our focus is on the exam. So from about sort of six half past six that's the end of my day no two days are ever the same um, and that's one of the things I like about this this work um, the lessons are really varied because of the context uh, because of the level because of the student so every every lesson is different 
Um, and this keeps me engaged and keeps me interested in what I'm doing. And I'm forever grateful for that. You know, I really like it. Um, plus, of course, as well, um, speaking to people all over the world. Um, and so despite the geographical distance, um, we, we feel quite close um, teaching online. It, it, it is more personal than you think it might be. Um, so that's sort of basically my day, uh, Monday to Friday. And at the weekend, I get a chance to relax. Mm -hmm.